our the cultural influence in the region is uh, supposedly very significant. Uh, their appeal as a democracy in the region is supposedly very significant. So all these uh, countries have a lot in common. I thought we are interested in promoting <laughs> ideas. <laughs> ideas matter. Maybe then everything will just fall into place if we have good ideas. Uh, no, no. Anyway, so, uh, something to think about. Food for thought. I don't think this is the uh, you know, final word on this. Okay. Uh, Changing subject, uh, I want to ask uh, to the, our uh, Chinese participants as well as you, uh, American participants, about the Korean elections next year. <coughs> One of the things that is uh, now very important for foreign players is that now Korean domestic politics is affect affecting foreign politi foreign affairs since. 2002 when the President Romian uh, took the office, there's a huge shift from Korean politics toward US, China, and North Korea. And there was another change in 2007. So if there's another change in 2012, we might expect another huge shift in terms of policy toward the United States, China, and North Korea. And uh, it is said that the North Korea wants to affect Korean politics for their own sake. So it is said that uh, North Korea would make another provocation to affect Korean politics. So in, if that's the case, then I think Chinese role will become more important. So if that is expected, like on other small provocation, on other provocations like Yang Pyong or China, then what will be Chinese position again? As 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 you as we already discussed that by those two events last year, the chi the Koreans attitude to China has been changed much, and it's more important. And I think Chinese position on Korean Peninsula will become more important for the public because there are two important elections in Korea. So I, I'd like to hear some 